Store shelves could soon empty out over a truck driver shortage. Here's CBS 13's Rachel Wolf. Keep on trucking. Despite the pandemic, drivers are delivering, but the number on the road is down. Uh, well, I know the industry overall is dramatically short of drivers. Mike Nord runs Western Truck School in West Sacramento. He's seen a dramatic shift in the number of drivers since the pandemic hit. He usually has 300 students a year. He now has half that. Because they're being paid by the government, uh, it's taking the incentive away to go to work and even go to school. He says two DMV shutdowns due to COVID caused backlogs. We were not able to take our students over to have them test to get their commercial driver's license. And physical distancing protocols impacted the number of students he could take on at a time. We've had to schedule uh, our training out farther because of the number of people that are allowed inside the truck. It's adding on to the time it takes to get certified by a couple of months, decreasing the number of diesel fuel drivers available, which in turn is impacting the bottom line, says driver Aaron Turner. Yeah, gas prices are out right we put in, I mean, this is going to cost $400, where two months ago it was three. So $100 extra Ten twi times a month. twice a week. Okay. Yeah, yeah, eight times a month. Yeah. Turner says the cost of fuel will trickle down to consumers as we head into summer. We're busy, but not busy enough. For now, Nord is working on a backlog of students who want to get trained and tested. He hopes access to vaccines will mean COVID restrictions will be eased. That will allow us to get more students training because we can have them working together where we can't do that right now.